it was, it was so rough for me before I'm going to the school and I can't believe it's getting shut down. For a lot of people, it feels like the ending of a community. NBC2 has learned a Collier County School is planning to shut down even though there is a waiting list of students trying to get in. That's the reality right now at Lorenzo Walker Technical High School in Naples. NBC2's Alexa Velez joins us from Collier County as students, former staff and county board members are trying to fix the situation and keep the school open. I spoke to a senior here who says closing the school in four years would be a mistake, but Collier County Public Schools says this will ultimately benefit everyone in the long run. It was, it was so rough for me before I'm going to the school and I can't believe it's getting shut down. For a lot of people, it feels like the ending of a community. The future of Lorenzo Walker Technical High School lies in the hands of Collier County Public Schools. An email sent out on the last day of school announced this year's incoming ninth grade students, the class of 2028, will be the last freshman class. CCPS noted that the wait list for technical programs is very long. Currently, only Lorenzo Walker High School graduates can attend the technical college next door. The district plans to make the technical college accessible to all juniors and seniors in Collier County. The district believes closing the high school will increase access to technical education, but senior Anthony Rivero disagrees. Higher ups, the superintendent and the board, they believe that this will give more opportunity to students, but we think it's actually cutting back opportunity. He says only students nearby would take advantage, not everyone. It's like, I'm not going to dual enroll at UF if I have to go there and it's a six hour drive. Like me, it's a hour bus drive here back. You think some Palmetto kid? is going to dual enroll there, have to, he has to go from his school in the middle of the day to there in 30 minutes. It's not even possible. It's not even possible. At yesterday's school board meeting, former Lorenzo Walker Technical High School principal reciprocated the sentiment. And then the final challenge is transportation. Even if the district provides it, students having to move back and forth to their zoned high school during the school day lose valuable instructional time. School board member Eric Carter actually graduated from the high school in 1996. I think there are a few people here that spoke tonight out, outside of, of, of the Lorenzo Walker family that don't understand exactly what the goal is and what we're trying to achieve. The, the, the ultimate end is to get more students to the technical college to get skilled workforce into the community. And that senior Anthony told me the students put together a petition that has over 1,000 signatures and they are planning a peaceful protest soon. Reporting live and local in Collier County, I'm Alexa Velez, NBC2.